Hi, everybody. I'm Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas. Good evening and welcome to the famed Boardwalk Hall in Atlantic City, New Jersey, where so many great fights have gone on through the years for our main event of the evening. Ten rounds in the middleweight division. This should be a really good matchup here tonight. All that energy that we saw it almost boiled over at the weigh-in yesterday. Now it gets to explode here in the ring. Green's making his way to the ring. You wouldn't know he's about to step into a fight. He looks like he's just out for a stroll. Holmes is coming down to the ring right now. Not seeing much personality out of this ring walk. Remember guys, obey my commands at all times. Let's have a good clean fight. Touch them up. Little get to know you here in the opening round scheduled for 10. He took a shot, but he came back with a right hand of his own. Teddy, if I put two fighters in front of you and said you can train, both of these guys have equal talent, but you can train the lefty, or you can train the righty, who would you pick? Well, usually the lefty has a little advantage because you haven't seen them too often. And that's always gonna be something that's gonna really serve them a little bit. But they might not have an advantage in the business end of it. A lot of guys won't fight your fighter. And then what are you gonna do? Able to cover up that gut. Circle. Move, move, keep on somebody. Man's left landing well. Good flush shot upstairs. What impact from that uppercut by the man. That worked out really well. Throwing off the right hand after getting tagged like that. Oh, you see him with the left of the head there? Halfway through this round, good block by Green. They're not exactly getting to know each other. They're just beating the hell out of each other early on here. Yeah, Joe, if this keeps up, they're both going to have headaches, and we're going to have one of the great fights to talk about. Nice work, the left hand to the head. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by Green. He took a shot, but he gives one of his own. A left hand scores. No, he missed that right. Green's now feeling the after effects of being rocked by a huge hook to the head. And he engages in the clinch. Oh, that's good one, stuff. Firing right back with one of his own. Good work by the man.
And we come to the end of the round. Boom, boom. Well, he's back in the corner, which is critical in terms of trying to stop the bleeding on that cut. But it's also critical because they need to put forth a new defensive game plan. Yeah, they have to make sure that they buy some time here and start moving their head, using their legs, tying up a little bit, doing anything to kill the clock and not get caught on that cut anymore. Now don't stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with this guy. Keep your distance, all right? You got to give me the double jab, champ. You're not giving me the double jab. You're only giving me one jab at a time, okay? You got that? Here we go. Round two is underway. Little head hunting with the left. Side, side. One, but gives one. Good work by the man. Solid left hand to the head. Reigns hurt from that. Oh, he's hurt right there. He is hurt. You know, his opponent's doing a good job of just being patient now and looking for that one good shot. Well, you know, the landscape of this business, the history of this business is littered with guys that they've had someone hurt, they get a little careless, they get caught. He better watch out that he doesn't get put on that landscape. The man's doing exactly what you should to be a strong defensive fighter. You gotta block those punches away. And he ties up on the inside. Good block by Green. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Green. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. The man's able to land a nice, clean left hand. Good exchange. He fires back. Sending out the power shot, it was a straight left hand. He got hit right there, but he also gave one. Solid effort by Green. And now he's targeting upstairs. A well-placed, gutsy uppercut after being tagged. See, the defense pays off as he gets rid of that downstairs. The man's able to land a good, solid left hand. Holmes is tagged by that powerful hook. Ten seconds remaining in this round. Wow! Late goings here of this round, and he goes down. Can he survive it? One, two, three, four, five. And there's the bell. He is saved by the bell. Oh, boy, Teddy, he's in a world of hurt now. Only 60 seconds in front of him. And you know what? Less than 60 seconds. It took them five seconds to get him on that stool. So right now, they can't concentrate just on telling them things, and he needs to be told why he got hit. But they got to get ice on him, and they got to right now, they have to revive him. quickly can he recover? That's one of the questions that'll be answered early on in this round after being knocked down in that last round. But what he has to do is go out there, be defensive-minded. I think get a little time early on. Don't worry about winning or pressing the first part of the round. Just get himself together, then start picking it up after that. That's a good sharp hook by Holmes. 
The man's able to land with these hooks with such ease, Teddy. What does his opponent need to do defensively? Well, that's a good question. What he's got to do, first of all, is not stand right in front of him where he can get him off. You know, walk around him a little bit. You know, if he does that, he'll make his opponent move his feet. He won't be able to get off those, those hooks, those shots. He won't be set. And you can see he wanted to do that as he holds on there. Keep moving. Keep moving. Good clean shot returning fire. Well done by the man. Circle it. Move, move, move. Coming to the halfway point of this third round. Nice strike after catching one by Green. Holmes is almost looking foolish that time he missed so badly. Able to block that away, it was targeted for his head. All out action throughout this round. Let's see how they finish it up. Scored well up top. The man's left working well that time. Another huge shot comes in early on in this fight from him. Well, he understood that his opponent, Joe, was a slow starter. He's jumping right on him, taking advantage. Up. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by Green. It's all and right. you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. Boom, boom. He's on the bad end of a very impressive hook up top. And this round comes to an end. Don't stand in front of him. You gotta watch the water in the corner. Too much. Now, I don't want to see you slug it out with this guy, all right? Keep your range and jab, jab, right, okay? You got any more of these? Round number four is underway. Boom Boom's got to feel pretty good about where things stand right now because he's still very much in this fight. It's anybody's fight, and even fight on your score. Card. Yeah, I think actually it's going to become a fight of attrition. Whoever's in better shape because this is every round being contested. I like the way he went up top that time with the hook. The man's so dangerous with that accuracy, a two-punch combination two. landing. One, two, just like that. Just like that. Teddy, what would you recommend based on what we're seeing here tonight? Well, two aspirin and then go... Oh, no, actually, I would say a little counter-punching would be just what the doctor ordered. That's a better prescription for me. Back at him with a left hand. There's no need to feel the inside. Good plus shot by Holmes. <laughs> Off to the side, a little swing and a miss going upstairs. Now just wasting away some time with that clinch. A little head hunting with the right. Stay away from the inside, baby. Stay away from the inside. Holmes's punch didn't come close. A stabbing right hand by Holmes.
He clinches when he gets to the inside. You get the sense that they know no other way how to fight. They are going at it, back and forth, toe-to-toe, -to -toe, punch for punch. Round four. Well, we've seen this before. A fighter with a bad cut, and sometimes a fighter that now has a much greater sense of urgency. Yeah, right now, if he was gambling, if he was in a casino, he's rolling the dice. He's hoping to come up with seven. Carry it away, you catch him. You got that? It's going to happen. You're going to catch him. You're going to... To live action now in what has been a closely contested fight. One of those fights that somebody is still waiting to break through and be a difference maker in. To the head he goes with a left hand. Nice block by Green. Scores well to the head with the right hand. Green's movement's really helping him out, avoiding that punch. Holmes is leaving himself wide open there. You just can't do that. Well, you can do it, but you're going to get paid. You're going to eat some leather. You're going to get punched in the mouth. That's going to happen. Scored left hand by Holmes. Boom Boom's proving to be elusive. And now just wasting everybody's time holding on. Took a shot, now he gives a left. Good double jab by Green. Keep moving, keep moving. Green's defense did a good job there, able to avoid that punch. with a good solid uppercut after taking a shot. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Well timed by Holmes. He took a step back, landed the counter punch. Exactly what he wanted to do. Boom Boom's giving his opponent headaches here now. He's throwing punches, but he's able to block them away. Oh, that's good stuff. Fire it right back with one of his own. Good work by the man. And the bell rings, signifying the end of the round. In between rounds here, Green's eye is completely swollen shut. What would you be telling him? Well, this is going to sound a little tiny harsh, but guess what? This is a tough business. I tell him, you have two eyes, right? Use the good one. Nice 
work, Key. Good job there, bro. Real nice. We got it. Okay, you're doing good. You're doing real well. Right. Now, oh, let's get some water. Down Take down. a deep breath. Come on now, relax, relax. You don't need that. No. Throw that away. Over the hump, the back end of the fight now begins. And now we got a fight. He fires back a right hand of his own. Took a shot, now he gives a left. The man's knowledge of the game is showing through. Three ways to defend, one of them is to block. He did it there well. <laughs> Gotta try to do better than that, he missed with that hook. Good block there by Green. That's exactly what he wanted to do, backing him up against the ropes. Very good defense by Boom Boom. He got hit right there, but he also gave one. Solid effort by Green. Keep working, keep working. Stay away from nice the block by Boom Boom. Right back at him with a left hand. Keep working the bus. We come to the end of this round. And for this fighter, I think that's a good thing because I was looking at him there, Teddy. It looked like he was breathing in and out of his mouth for most of that round. Yeah, and that's a bad sign. That means that the gas tank is a little low. He's low on petrol. Listen, I need to see more competitions, okay? We got Whenever he misses, go. Keep your hands right. moving. Oh, Keep well, busy. Okay, you don't need that. No, throw that away. And we are back underway. Another round in a fight that's been very entertaining. But I wouldn't want to be a judge. This is one of those fights that could go either way. Clean shot, returning fire. Well done by Green. Stay on Not able side. to connect with the uppercut. Nice strike after catching one by the man. That's what I like to see. That's my man. Keep fighting me. with that headshot. <laughs> Takes a step back, then the counterpunch by Holmes. Very similar to what you see Floyd Mayweather do. You know, make a miss, 
pull that shoulder back, and then come right back with the counts. Blocked by Boom Boom. He just missed that. Reigns! Rush! And bang and away he goes. Oh, and he goes down again. The question is, can he rise up and continue on? One, two, three, four, five. Reigns going to have to pull himself together here. Now he beat the count but still a lot of work to do. Yeah, a lot of work because he doesn't have the benefit of his legs. Can't move. Oh, and there you go. That was a big shot that Florida, and it's a big shot that may end him right here. That looked like the great pitch of great Maddox. His sinker ball. Boy, it went down quick. legs are not in good shape right now. He showed some gumption in getting up off the canvas. I don't know that he's going to last. Really good work right there, landing the two punches in sequence by Holmes. Tucks those elbows in, blocks the body shot. Keep moving, keep moving. Good block there by Holmes. If you're standing straight up, move that body. You need to move that body more. Miss John, okay, go. I need you to take three pitch fighting his fight. You're fighting on the inside with this guy. Now I want you to use the ring and keep your distance. As we start round number eight, I want to take a look at Teddy's scorecard, and I also want to ask you of an underlying storyline that's developing here. Because yes, you have him up, but that's because he has scored knockdowns. This is a very close fight, and his opponent is hanging in there. Could he be discouraged because of that? Obviously, that can always happen, but part of being a professional fighter and you want to become a champion is you do not allow yourself to go into those mental corridors. Just look at the way he is right now, Teddy. Green's breathing right through his mouth. His mouth's wide open. That's a telltale sign. Yeah, he's bent. I mean, we know what he can't do now. It looks like he can't really throw punches. You know, he can't keep a pace. But what can he do? He can grab on. He can hold. He can get time off the clock. Boom Boom's like a piece of Velcro against his opponent recently here. He seems like he's clinching more after that knockdown. Yeah, that's exactly what he has to do right now. Now he has to be able to just get past this little bit. It's kind of like being in a bad rapids. You know, you're going down with waterfalls. You better be in a canoe. You better be in something. This is his canoe. This is his raft. Grabbing on to his opponent. Nothing there on the punch by Green. by Boom Boom. man's 
isn't playing one of the three facets of good fundamental defense. And right now he's using the legs. Yeah, he is, and that is one of the facets. The others to block, the others to move your head. And right now he's controlling range. What his opponent has to do now is... Big, big shot. He goes down, and he doesn't look good at all. Reigns gonna need a minor miracle to survive this. He's gonna need a great will and desire to survive it. One, two, three, four, five. Six. The ref is stopping this fight. The man's gunned down yet another opponent. A knockout victory. It's late in the fight, and it looked like we were going to get a decision out of it.